introduce you to my husband. He's also a writer. Two writers, one marriage. How do you manage those imaginations? <laughs> oh, it's fine. We Prozac. Were just... Jennifer is pumping out one book after the next, and look what it's doing to her career. New York Times bestseller list? Are you kidding? That's huge. Yeah, we're all proud of her. Did you get the invitation to our salon? We invite all our favorite artists. You have to come and read your work. David, you should read something, too. Huh? You need to learn how to play the game a little. Networking is part of the work. Read a little bit from your book tomorrow at the salon. Don't be weird. Come on. David, let's go! Yeah. Where's the wine? Well, it's wheelchairs, so it's a car sharing service. There's a package in my car that says bees on it. Does it say live bees? No, it just says bees. And you're fine. Let's just try this place. You never know. Things are different when you leave the city. Look right here. They've got wine. Hey, is this good? Lady over there, nice dress. My wife, she stepped outside, she disappeared. Wait, your wife is missing? We pulled over here to buy some wine. They don't sell wine here. Sure they do, the Palazzo di Carmela. That's bum's milk. I'll tell you what, you go to that party, and she shows up there, just give us a call. When baby girl asked about daddy, mama said he cracked. What are you working on? I never talk about my writing. I'm working on a novel of my own about a guy who has teeth growing in all sorts of strange places, like in his armpits. I'm thinking of moving to Detroit. My friend Jeremiah moved to Detroit and he got shot in the face. And he's gonna make a documentary about it, you know? Where did he get the funding? Indiegogo. I wanna get shot in the face. She's not here. Yeah, I don't have anything for you yet. This is starting to feel like Gone Girl situation, and she hated that book. Hello? Hello? Some men can't handle a strong woman. You're completely overshadowed by your wife. You'll always be known as J.M. Lee's husband. Uh, cool. Something more than love. Something more than love. Does this smell right to you? No. What's the kinkiest thing you've ever done? What's your name? David Warwick. Okay, right there, that's tough. It doesn't have a ring to it, you know what I mean? You want something that pops, you know, ringing of bells. Ding! 